very sad and very amazing story of a seven-year-old girl who was the only survivor of a small plane crash. Investigators hope that young Sailor Gutzler, who you see on the left-hand side of your screen, can shed some light on this deadly accident which happened Friday night in Kentucky. Both her parents, her sister and her little cousin, were all killed in this crash, but somehow she managed to pull herself out of the wreckage, hike nearly a mile through the woods, and then she found a door, a home, knocked on that door and asked for help. She told me that her parents were dead. Uh, I asked her how she knew that, and she said, well, I tried, to, I tried to wake them up, and I couldn't wake them up. Laura Engels following this story from our New York City newsroom. So where does the investigation go from here in all of this, Laura? Hi, Martha. An incredibly sad story indeed. And federal investigators will be inspecting the wreckage of the Piper PA-34 plane that was moved yesterday from the crash site to try to determine what went so terribly wrong Friday night. A mangled mess of metal was all that was left of the plane that was carrying that family from Nashville, Illinois, returning home from vacation in Key West, Florida. A spokesperson for the National Transportation Safety Board said it will take about 10 days to issue a preliminary report on the crash. This while heaping on Praise for that seven-year-old Sailor Gutzler, who not only survived the deadly crash, but was able to go for help in the dark, bleeding, lightly dressed, in the cold, and with a broken wrist. Investigators say she, she will be their best hope to find out what happened. Having someone that is a witness always helps us in the, in the investigation. It gives us um, kind of a storyline. What we do know, Sailor Gutzler's father, Marty, was flying the plane. The 48-year-old pilot, his wife, Kimberly, Sailor's 9-year-old sister, Piper, and 14-year-old cousin, Sierra, all died in the crash. Marty Gutzler uh, reported engine trouble, then lost contact with air traffic controllers around 5.55 p.m. Friday. Controllers reportedly tried to direct him to an airport that was just a few miles from the crash scene. Martha? Oh, terrible story. So do we know any more about how the little girl is doing, Laura? Yeah, well, the 7-year-old was checked out at a local hospital and has since been released to extended family members. An NTSB spokesperson tells Fox this morning they have not yet scheduled their interview with her, but hope to talk to her very soon, hopefully this week. One NTSB investigator called Sailor Gutzler one remarkable young lady. Meanwhile, a fund has been set up for Gutzler donations to Sailor Gutzler's behalf. They're being accepted on the website you see here uh, below at www.sailorgutzlerfund.com. Right. Laura, thank you very much.